Hey everybody, welcome back to the Broken Monkey Gamers. My name is Grim and this is War on the Sea. We're going to continue our campaign in the North Atlantic, but before we do that, as a reminder to everyone, if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button if you like the videos. Hit the bell icon to be notified of future videos. And leave comments because we love hearing from you guys. Let's jump in. Alright, here we are. Let's take a look, see what's going on. Uh, we did take over the Azores, and we are headed over to uh, Algiers with our little little fleet there, guys. We've got this task force headed in there. They're headed back. We, he's just running around because all the action seems to be happening out here just outside of Liverpool. Okay, so let's just see how things are going to go. I don't know. All right, so it's now the morning. This is potentially some dangerous stuff. He do, they don't have the range. Let's see if I can get some new air going out here. I can. Now, you guys said you wanted to see some different stuff. Kind of limited here. These guys do have bombs and maybe torpedoes. Yeah, they have torpedoes, but they're so slow. I'm going to start out with the Lancasters again. Uh, we'll get... Wait a minute. Start with Lancasters. Get these guys out. And we will finish off whatever big is going with the torpedo planes, or maybe the, the Spitfires with the rockets. There we go. We'll get all that done. Now we've got six aircraft. Ooh, that is... Ooh, what's going on? Where are they at? Where are they at? Oh, there they are. Okay. Let's just hit pause for a second. What do we got? It looks like all we got here there we go, is destroyers. All right, so with that being said, I'm gonna get everybody in a group. We're just gonna form it up. And I guess we will head out this way and we'll go here. Let's get the speed going up a little bit and we'll hit that. Oh, it's kind of quiet. I must have turned the volume down. I don't know if you guys prefer it like this or not. It's kind of quiet. You guys like the volume this low? Kind of wondering. Okay, seeing that these guys are destroyers and they're going to be turning every which way, I've got six. Numero uno here. We'll target you. Attack. We'll target you. Attack. We'll target you. Attack. Sorry. See, look at this. It just keeps jumping out at me. Targeting you, attack, and targeting you, attack. Now, who's interesting? You're not interesting. Um, you look like you're already getting ready to, to, to sink. You look like you're getting ready to sink. Hmm. I'm gonna take the last guy and we'll go after you. All right. Everyone's gonna. Change up a little bit. Let's see who's going to get who first. I think this guy is going to get be the first one up. If he starts to turn, which I think he's turning a little bit, he might be able to avoid... I don't know, maybe. These guys aren't turn. I probably should have had two attacks on that guy. Hmm. Oh, well. Very good chance he avoids what's going on. Um, he might still get hit, but I don't know. Oh, there's some hits over there. Ooh, there's some hits here. Some near misses. It's 
So it looks like maybe three ships. Um, we oh wait, that's a magazine explosion on five. Where's number five? Oh, I think you were. No, yeah, you're gonna be done. So I'm thinking. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe some of these guys are gonna drop. Hard to say. But now that I remember that these are all destroyers, it's definitely going to be. Um, it's definitely gonna be the the uh, Spitfires with the rockets, because those guys one one or two planes hits and it's done. I think you're gonna be done. I'm surprised you're still afloat. You've got to be heavy. Let's see if they can look at the report. Tell us what's going on here. We've got oh we've got three criticals, one heavy. But two critical criticals, so that means there's well, there's two ships that, that should be sinking. And I do believe he's this one's going down. I do believe that's what's gonna happen here. Let's see. If the water gets into that window, they're in trouble. Are they getting rid of the, the I don't know. I don't know. Hard to say. Let's take a look at the retreat. You're looking okay. You're not doing too good. You are definitely not doing too good. You're barely holding it together. How are you looking? You look like you're... Yeah, you got a little bit of a list there. This is probably the other critical. What about you? How are you faring? You're probably heavy. I'm willing to bet you get these fires put out real quick. But I just can't see how you're not... I don't know, man. You seem to be doing real well here. I don't know. Is she still sinking? I don't know. It doesn't look like it. I think she's got the... Looks like she's got the flooding under control, guys. Maybe they'll scuttle some of these ships. Really, we have to wait till we all get down to zero, huh? All right. Ah, uh, we did scuttle one of them. All right, we hit return to base. I wonder if we can launch before they do that. Nope. I'm gonna adjust the sound a little bit because it's a little bit low. So give me just a moment here, guys. All right, we're back. I think I got the volume sorted. I increased it just a little bit. Hopefully, not too much. Oh, so there they are. Let's see. Can we launch? I don't think we can. No, we can't. And you don't... I don't think you guys have the... It doesn't seem like you wouldn't have the range. Gibraltar's got to wait another hour. Okay. They they appear to be leaving. Oh, they, they are not leaving. And look at you. All right. Let's see what we could do here with the uh, this sub. I know you guys like a, a good lot of sub action. We're gonna go silent. I'm gonna throw the scope up. Okay. Well, we found somebody. Oh, there they are. What do we got here? Hmm. Some destroyers. Not really too concerned with destroyers. Let's see, drop the scope. Give these guys a little distance. Okay. Yeah, there's no need to tussle with three destroyers. That's just suicide. And we don't do that kind of thing. One launcher here, mm -hmm. huh? We don't do the suicide thing. That kind of looks like a 50 cal, maybe a 20 millimeter. That's a 20. Hmm. Okay. Should be going to, thank you, zero. Now, those guys could be dropping off supplies, but like I said, it's not really something I plan to worry about. 
I'm more worried about these guys bringing stuff over. Okay, what do we have? Because I'm going to have to start... I'm going to get another uh, transport. And I'm going to just back and forth with this tra with one of these transports. And then I'll go from here to hitting here. Um, what's going to hurt is... Going from here all the way to there. Because this, this guy's done. And I can't launch any aircraft from there. Which is weird. Uh, hoping I don't have to deal with. Oh wait a minute. Okay. Can I can I send some guys that way? I can. So we have. We only got four of these. Let's get the rockets out. Let's do that. Let's hit these guys right out there. Only going 80 miles. Um. Now these guys are fighters, so I could potentially launch another group, right? I can't. Okay, they won't let me do that. All right. All right, so we know that there's... Ooh, let's see what we got. Four. Well, we can get one each, can't we? Come on. There we go. Then we do this. We do this. We do break we do this we target you and we attack we target you and we attack we target you we attack and we target you and we attack so everyone's gonna be moving upside down that's okay there we go Everyone's coming in. Just a second. There we go. Now I don't have these guys going full speed. Most of the time when I have them go full speed, you guys tell me I'm not doing it right. I shouldn't be doing it that way. I understand. Well, there we go. See, you're making that change. Gonna dive. Oh, you're on the other guy. And little bitty hits. Did you get any? There's a little bitty hits. Oh, that might have been enough. Oh, we lost two though. We might lose even more. Why? Because we weren't going fast. Oh yeah, someone sank. Wow, these little rockets seem to be far more effective than almost anything else I've got. I wonder how that is. They're not big rockets. They don't have big warheads. I mean, it has to be the angle of attack. Rounds coming down through the very thin top. Because I'm willing to bet that these decks here are not more than... See, there you go. Look at number two. These decks are not more than an inch thick. Everything's designed, I guess, to be... The, the turrets are protected pretty well, but the decks, I don't think they are. Well, they just lost two destroyers. How's this one doing? This one, um, I'd be surprised if this one makes it. Let's take a look at the report. Oh, look, that's a critical critical. Number four is probably going to sink. And that or she be right here. She's rolling over. That leaves one little destroyer left, and that one's on fire. Wow. Hmm. I gotta say, guys, I'm impressed with them. I mean, you guys should be impressed, too. It took one Spitfire with some rockets. I mean, I, these guys were, weren't that... Some of them were damaged like crazy, but some of them weren't. I think I had a heavy and maybe two criticals walking around. But that's gonna leave this guy, who at this point in time is heavy, heavy. So the destroyers that we have should be able to take it out. So I'm not worried at all. I don't suppose we have those destroyers here right now, do we? No, we do not. Okay. Mm. And this should be turning to zero any second now. Thank you. Let's hit these boys home. All right, so I'm not worried about you any longer. You're gonna go in there. Um, I don't see any res re uh, any bases being, you know, improved here. 
This one's still the same. I haven't hit it again. Because I was losing a lot of battle, a lot of uh, heavy bombers to do that. Ooh. Do you want to see if you want to... I think you guys want to try out... Let me see. You want to try... Oh, let's do this. I don't need that many, and I certainly don't need that, but I will take a torpedo. I'll take four. I will take these guys. I will head them over here, and there's a very good chance my destroyers are going to get in on the action on this fight. There we go. These are called uh, wyverns. Wyvern. There we go. Drop it down, guys. These look pretty modern, these these aircraft. Like the end of the war kind of thing. Look at that. Counter-rotating propellers. Of course, the British torpedoes look kind of weird, but... These guys also carry rockets and bombs. They got all that stuff. Okay. Okay, we're going to hit break. We're going to hit this, and we're going to see if we get everyone to attack. We are. Now, they are not in formation on this attack, so they should all go after the same point. They're coming in pretty good. Now, I'm hoping they don't drop foolishly. Because for some reason, the AI in this with this mod, these British... These guys drop way too early. Come on. That one might have been a little bit in the back end. Oh, it went right underneath. Damn. Those are going to miss, too. Yeah. Although, um, oh wait, maybe that one won't miss. Looks like that one's probably going to hit. The other's going to miss, though. But it might go underneath. What do you think? No underneath shots. That one probably was too close. But I don't, I don't know. Let's take a look. How bad is this going to be? If these portholes here go underwater, which it looks like they're about to do, that could be bad. We didn't lose anybody. How bad is it? What's the report say? Critical, critical, huh? Mm. Chances are this one's going to sink because now the portholes are underwater. She's slowing down. Oh, yeah, that's probably not a good sign. Mm -hmm. Hey, the portholes are no longer. Okay, yes, they are. All right, guys. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. We get those guys back. I know you guys... See, I know you guys wanted to see different aircraft because someone asked me that in the comments, but the reality of it is there's not a lot of different aircraft except for on our carrier. Because if you look, they're all about the same. Lancasters, the Wyverns, Spitfires. Now, the bow fighters we've seen in the other campaigns. Uh, these are all new. Spitfires were... Well, they didn't really use the Spitfires in the other campaigns that much. The thing about the Malta... Uh, the Malta is the Malta does have... Uh, I don't want to launch aircraft. I just want to... I can just do this, huh? Do, 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 do. British aircraft carrier. Mark Royale. Victorious Malta. So they've got Sea Furies, which I'm not really sure what that is, but there's a lot of them. It's a fighter. The Sea Hornets, I think it's like a Mosquito. Uh, the Sea Fire, which is a Spitfire, and then the Wyverns. They have a lot of aircraft on this, this aircraft carrier. I mean, it is circa 1946 after the war kind of thing, but... So, let's get us going. I'm not sure what happened to the, the, the German fleets that were out here in the Atlantic. Um... Now remember, we only have to take four bases. Algiers, Italian uh, Mediterranean forces, La Havre, and German Northern forces. Those are the four ports we need to take. And we had to get this one going up to level five, and we had to keep all these. 
So I haven't seen them even make an attempt at any of our bases yet. Um, it would be nice. Oh, see what I mean? See what I mean? We do have something right here. You, oh, Task Force 9. We are going to unload all the cargo. Blam. We can do that. This might be a... Uh, we might be doing okay. We're going to come out. Because, uh... Oh, Task Force 9. Oh, you know what? Let's begin. This will be interesting, guys. Well, maybe it won't. Yeah, because I've only got our destroyers out here. They didn't include uh, the second fleet, which was the, the sub. Now, I know that the targets are going to be out in front of us. So we're going to go up full speed. Full speed. Hmm. And we'll we'll get us some some distance here. Boy, that last guy was almost on the beach, wasn't he? Oh, yeah, that's pretty shallow. No, that's not that bad. Now let's see, what do we got? Now it's entirely possible. Hmm. Yeah, these guys are too far away for us to find. So we got to get a lot closer. All right, so with that being said, I'm gonna head out this way, head out this way, head out this way, and what do I wanna do with this guy? I guess I'm gonna come out to here. <clears throat> Let's see, what do we got here? Four ships, maybe some destroyers. Hmm. What do we wanna do? You know, the, these Lancasters are really doing it. You know what? It's more fun watching these guys, isn't it? With the rockets. So we'll, we'll send these guys out here to take care of that. We're going to keep the Lancasters for other things. There we go. It's kind of different, you know? Oh, look, at, we got a lot. That's 18 of them. Oh, there they Oh, there they are. What do we have? Okay, what do we got here? I got four and a half, 18. That means I can do six groups of three. Six is six. I can do six. Let's see. Destroyer. What the an Italian destroyer? They're still running around with Italian. What are three Italian destroyers doing out here? Let me see here. Wait a minute. What am I missing? I got this one. I got this one. Um, I guess I can do a line ahead. I can take this one and go to this one. Do line ahead and I take this one. And I do this one and I form up the line ahead. Okay. Drop down. Drop down. Drop down. There we go, we're dropping down. See if I can just do this. I hit this button and then everyone attacks. Everyone is attacking. Look at that. And they're all doing it single. That's fine. There we go. I'll start shooting in just a minute. Where are you going? You guys are going right there. You guys haven't started firing yet? You're kidding. There you go. It's still a little quiet though, isn't it? I mean, you guys might shoot down one or two before he fires, but I think they're getting ready to dive. Yeah, they are. That's going to be painful. 
Hell yeah. Hey, what about you guys? Wait a minute. Are we all going to the same guy? That was not what my intentions were, but I guess I screwed that up. Well, I guess we guaranteed we'll take out one of these guys. Let's do this. Let's get everybody targeting you and come in for another. We'll do a strafe. We'll just strafe. How about that? We're going to get our money's worth. We're going to come in and we're going to strafe, the, strafe this destroyer. There we go. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, these guys are coming in. Let's attack those at this other guy. Oh geez, that was not right. What are you guys doing? Little aerobatics there, flying in upside down and backwards. Let's see what we got here. There we go. There's some there's some shooting and scooting. There we go. All right. Let's get everybody out of here. There you go. Probably gonna fly right over these guys again, aren't you? Right, uh, maybe not. Well, we sank one. We damaged these two others pretty darn good. I'm not gonna risk any more aircraft when I know I got just two destroyers left and both of them are hurting. What's the report say? Minor might my, yeah, our strafing's not doing a whole lot. But look at this. Orders. Form up. And go right there. And we're gonna look at this. We're gonna get full out. We should be. There we go. And we're going to return to base with everybody intact to get repairs. I know a lot of you guys ask me the question, why do I not, you know, just uh, follow through with it? But it is conservation of, uh, of you know, military assets, basically. I, it takes a while for me to regenerate aircraft. Um, you've seen it other other places that I've got 12 Lancasters, okay? That's just... Um, a level four base. You go over here. We start looking at level fours, level fours, level fives. Um, look at this. Twelve. So twelve is about what it's going to be. Because I was bombing, doing strategic bombing, uh, I got knocked down and it's starting to build back up. And I don't want to be caught with my pants down without any bombers or fighters in case something comes in. When I, you know, and I know that repairs are going to happen instantly. You know, that's the, that's the way the game mechanics work. Um, in real life, you're right, I would do it that way, but I have to play the game according to game mechanics and how the game mechanics translate real life tactics. So sometimes I will be doing stuff that you guys don't agree with, and I, I do apologize for that. Oh, Task Force 9? Um, hmm. You know what I could do? I wonder if I can do that just for this moment. Merge the group. Oh, I can! Yes! 
let's try it out. So we got the sub in the back. We know what's going on. By the way, when I say we got the sub in the back, is the sub surfaced? I bet you you are surfaced. Oh, you're not. What do we got? Oh, oh, there they are. There they are. So, you guys are going as fast as you possibly can. And what I need you guys to do is go this way. Okay, you are not... I'm going to break you off. Um, and I want you to go this way, full speed. Because they're not even going to be thinking about you. This is the first time, guys, in all the series I've done, they're back over there, where I've actually had a sub with, with surface warfare ships. So these destroyers are going to have fun firing. I'm going to send them up to the cap to T here. And I'm going to send this guy down in low. They're not even going to be paying attention that there's a sub in this group. Um, they are kind of caught. They will probably start to maneuver towards my guys. Um, hmm. Let's see, Italian? Another Italian? What is this? Jesus, guys. What, you, you got a sail there? What is that, a sail? It is a sail. It's got to be a sail. Why would you have a sail? That's crazy. Can't be a sail. I don't even know what that is. Someone tell me what this thing is. It looks like it's a sail that's been, you know, um, tied down. But it could be something else. Like a tarp. You know, if it gets hot or something. I don't know. I do not know. What's this over here? This is my one German destroyer. These are escorts, it looks like. And I only say that because they don't have enclosed turrets. Usually the ones that don't have enclosed... Damn, you are already on fire. You're another German. So we got one German, one Italian, two Germans and one Italian. These are escorts. How are you guys doing? You're not going very fast. You know, it would probably be better if you picked up speed. I'm just saying. Because he's going 36. Now these, I think, are destroyers, but they, you know, by my definition, they could be escorts. But I think they might be destroyers. I think the destroyer escorts are more along the lines of frigate and corvette classes. So they're probably just stronger. I mean, uh, shorter. What am I saying stronger for? I don't even know. So you should be picking up speed, which you are. And you should be picking up speed, which you haven't begun to do yet. It would be nice if you did that, because being a target sucks. But I'm going to let you guys do this on your own, because I'm going to focus in on my sub here. Which, um... Is still... Oh, see, there we go. We're going to hit break. And we're going to hit right this way. Right this way. Because he's coming right at us. Oh, wow. These guys with them little, what are these, 5 inch guns probably? I think we're firing 5 inch guns. Let's take a look. What do we got? Mm, type 3. And, oh, 4 inch guns. Okay, 4 inch guns? Hmm. Interesting, 4 inch guns. Maybe they are destroyer escorts. I don't. I don't recall. I think I, I did pick up destroyers. These guys have dropped off their troops and supplies. Looks like you are finally picking up speed, sir. I appreciate that. But this guy's coming on strong. I don't know. And what are you guys doing? You guys are going away. Why are you guys leaving him to face these guys alone? That seems strange to me. It really does. 1934. Yeah, 1940. Type 1934A. To be early war destroyer probably that's why I was thinking if it is a destroyer and it's got that um, open turrets it must be early war boy you just got a lot of see they're capping the T Ooh, that's a nice hit they're capping the T so all their guns um, right now are firing and what do we got here we got one in back we got the two in front um, 
and they're all firing now he's actually got four single guns we've got three doubles so where he's got four inch or four guns probably four inch we've got six plus we've got all three of our guys firing um, now these guys if they're shooting it looks like they might be no they're not they're, they will the hell are these things howitzers man they're, they've got that such a long distance hmm what about you um you guys wow yeah you guys got five singles this is a different one than the last one I think yeah yeah this guy's this guy doesn't have as many does he oh he does he's got five I didn't see this little one but he's taking a lot of hits and he's got a little bit of a list to starboard going there he's also trying to fire port Oh, one of my guys is taking damage. What are we doing here? What's the deal? Let's get that fire put out, please. Well, apparently, Mr. Uh, type 1934 has found the range. Although he's taking a lot more damage than he's dishing out. break let's start with the solution here let's start going this way there we go well, he's taking a lot of damage you're going 30 uh, you're going eight knots 8,000 range At most I'll fire two there we go probably throw some sonar wouldn't make much of a difference wait a minute didn't I put your your scope up? Yeah, your scope's up now. There we go. That should help with the solution. I think it is. We want to really scare this guy. We really want to scare him. I start hitting the active sonar. He's going to be going, what the hell's going on? Because with all these explosions going around, I doubt their sonar is really, um, they're even listening to it. Because at his speed of 23 knots, he's not going to hear anything. And the, those explosions are going to hurt that dude's ears. Radar, if they have radar, that would be good. But um, I'm not sure I'm seeing any kind of radar. I see uh, a direction, fire director up here. Spotlights. I am not seeing any radar. Old-fashioned crow's nest for some dude to stand there. That would be a brave lad. Now he's got two sets of torpedo launchers, which he has not launched. He's got some AAA up here and here. Maybe here, but I think that's fire direction. That's fire direction for the... I think. He's taking some hits. How are we doing here? Well, yeah, see, we're having a little bit of a problem. So we're going to have to slow down a bit so that we, we stop spreading that fire. Now, that, I believe, is a fire direction and possibly radar. Because it looks like radar. So we're going to slow him down. Now, he's actually getting ready. getting ready these guys are still making a run for it they are not having this whole you know help our buddy out thing what are we at 66 we're still at 6,000 yards now I'm pretty sure I got range I just don't feel good about it of course he's down to two knots so if I hit break and I just start headed right towards him that would be pretty good So how are we doing here? It looks like we're, yeah, we really want to stop that fire in the magazine. Once we get that fire put out, we'll, we'll pick up speed again. Has he stopped firing? 
No, he just started firing at this guy now. Which is odd. They usually don't do that. What do we got left here? Three seconds. There we go. Let's pick up speed once again. Where is his buddies at? Can't even see him anymore. They, they should be visible. Like right out in here. Hmm, let's do this. He's over there. see him all right I'm gonna head you guys out what are you doing you don't look too good you got a few fires going let's get these fires put out okay and since you are closing in, and you've got 6,000 yards? Oh, I'd say we just fired a few shots. He's not even moving. I'm going to fire both shots. There we go. Not too worried about this guy. Hit break, and then I'm going to head this way. Okay. Now let's hope that these two shots will take care of it. Damn. Kind of felt that was going to happen. What a waste. Wasted two torpedoes. They probably, this guy will probably sink before they even get there. Um, are we actually turning? No, it doesn't look like we're turning. All right, so let's just do this. Let's just hit break. Let's see, you're going, th let's just go this way. You, you're gonna go this way. And you, you're gonna go um, this way. Let's see, you're going 35, 30 something. You got some damage. Let's take a look at the damage here. This should be getting done in a second. That's going to take a minute. That's going to take a minute. No one's shooting at you, though. So there's that. That one's done. Uh, get the flooding taken care of. What do we got here? Retreat. Yeah, these guys are just... They're not... I don't know what they're doing. They're just running for it. So let's just do that. Now, I will separate this sub right after this, this fight is over. Too bad though. It's too deep. Can't see it. Really? That's deep. I guess it is deep out there. It's... Look at that. Torpedoes just went. Shoo! What a hit! What a hit! Wait a minute. What are you doing? Who told you to just keep turning, man? I did not say do that. I said go that way. That's weird. Drop the scope. Turn silent off. Surface the boat. There we go. Now you can. Oh, you only going 15? We'll throw that up. Radar. How are you guys doing? Radar. How are you doing? Okay. You should be getting very close to getting that fire put out, sir. Looks like the flooding's taken care of. Except for that one spot. There you go. Let's get. Oh, you're already up to third. Okay, we're good. Now we should be ready. Thank you to leave. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. You, sir, let's do this before I forget because you know I'm going to forget. Oh, wait a minute. I don't want to do that. Uh, split the group. That's what I want to do. There we go. There we go. Um. Okay, and then you, sir, Task Force 5, you're going the way I want you to go. Outstanding. 
Well, everyone's moving, guys. Uh, and to be honest, we kind of have run out of time for this episode. Not a lot of happened, but we did destroy some more ships. Let's take a quick look at our losses. We've lost a sub and 51 aircraft. That's not good. The enemy has lost... Come on, there we go. Lots of destroyers, a heavy cruiser, heavy cruiser, light cruiser, light cruiser, heavy cruiser, battleship, heavy cruiser, heavy cruiser, light cruiser, heavy cruisers. Oh, let's see, heavy cruisers, light cruisers, heavy cruisers, um, heavy cruiser, heavy cruiser, heavy cruiser, another battleship, light cruiser, heavy cruiser. Let's see, lots of destroyers. Oh, okay, there you go, lots of destroyers, really. Two battleships, they have lost. Wait, there's probably more. Oh, there is more. Uh, destroyer, 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 lots of destroyers. They, they, geez, lots of destroyers. They've just been chunking out destroyers lately. They've lost 52 ships, two of them being battleships. That's harsh. They've only lost 17 aircraft, wow. Well, they're not really launching a whole lot now, are they? But anyway, guys, uh, this is the end of the episode, so we'll stop it here. We are the Broken Monkey Gamers. My name is Grim. This is War on the Sea. Please subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button if you like the videos. Hit the bell icon to be notified of future videos. Be notified of future videos. That's the way I should have said it. And uh, leave comments, guys. I love hearing from you. Anyway, enjoy the videos. Uh, that's what I got to say. Usually I say something like, until the next time, enjoy the videos. You know, I don't even remember what I say anymore. Guys, enjoy the videos. I'll see you later. Shiny, I want to touch it.